So do this bit here, but <laughs> I will uh, for now, and then I'll drop it out. Basically, what I do is I want to bring uh, to you a little bit of. Um, Oh, here we go. It's so usually like this in the lecture room as well. <laughs> a bit of uh, RTC. So this is sort of something that you get there. This is a physical thing that came from there. So I'm bringing a bit of uh, merchandise, basically. <laughs> um, and that's your little um, delegates um, thing there. And also, I've, I'm bringing an additional thing here, which is uh, something I picked up from the first presentation I'm going to, that I've been to, and I'm going to give it to you here as well. And that's a, a little cap from my mates at Tourist. Mm -hmm. All right, so uh, they were brilliant disguise. And um, I, I really enjoyed it. I mean, I was looking forward to this for, for a while before I got there, and um, uh, it was a um, it, it was quite good to actually um, uh, see it in the end. It was what it, I thought it would be. So uh, basically, just to put a face to it as well, there's something else I'm doing. Um, these are the guys. This is um, young Mike. Uh, that's me. With the, this is at the uh, gala night at the end. That's his lovely wife um, Anne. They're from America. And um, and this is the other guy that works with him, young Josh, uh, here. So uh, brilliant people, down to earth, uh, like-minded people, uh, willing to help, especially institutions like TAFE and that sort of thing. Uh, free to give, happy to give anything, anything to us. All right. So um, I'll start off with our PowerPoint. Basically, this is set at uh, in May 29, uh, 2044, so 30 years from now and uh, what it's going to be like. And uh, I personally, I've got an interest in the future myself. <laughs> so uh, it was interesting to listen to these guys. Uh, a lot of the stuff they actually talked about, you know, uh, sort of new as well. But uh, nevertheless, I, I probably took the most notes. So I didn't know everything. <laughs> so um, the disclaimer was quite funny. Uh, basically, don't uh, make any decisions, business decisions or investments or based on what we're going to say because they're just basically a couple of comedians anyway. And um, says, uh, obviously, uh, you must have enough, um, not have found a better class to attend if you are sitting here listening to this stuff. So that's at the, the bottom fine print. Uh, so it just shows, it shows their character. Oh, we'll run through this. Uh, this is the little, the little slide that uh, we were able to download. Um, what, uh, Cam uh, sorry, Stuart was saying before. So um, just to, this is Melbourne in 2044, they reckon. <laughs> okay, so uh, take note. That's the Flintstones in the UFO or something. <laughs> oh, sorry, Jetsons. <laughs> okay. Oh, whatever. I don't know who they are <laughs> back in the day. <laughs> anyway, this is this is interesting. The driverless car. It's got a steering wheel still, and um, and uh, yeah. So you'd be able to have your cup of coffee and it will drive you somewhere. I suppose that's getting closer and probably more likely that it will happen. Uh, I don't know what that is. And there you go. <laughs> oh, you might want to see that. Um, and uh, yeah, the telephone, how far it's come, you know, so this is the way they set it out uh, to start with, a, a super fast internet to download all that stuff that you couldn't download, Stuart, <laughs> and uh, <laughs> the computer and uh, we'll check it out. <laughs> all right, I don't know what that is. Anyhow, robots, robots everywhere, we've got those already. Um, so that's uh, State of BIM 2014 uh, on the site. Uh, so yeah, this sort of stuff we can do already, um, lay out cables and that sort of thing. Um, quite accurately from, from the BIM and uh, through, um, you know, downloading into different sort of surveying uh, machines. Um, I just want to get to a slide here. Uh, okay, here we go. The quadcopters, have talked a fair bit about uh, quadcopters um, there and how they're going to be improved in the future and how we'll be able to assemble stuff on site. Uh, you'll see a bit of that in a minute. I uh, will run through these uh, point stuff uh, uh, just in case we missed anything in a minute. Uh, <coughs> the, um, you know, the uh, 3D printers coming in. Uh, right, now this, this is the construction site now in 2014, what it looks like. All right, mess everywhere. This is the, the office, drawing office. <laughs> yes, <laughs> markups and all that sort of stuff, you know, transportation of all this uh, pipe work and whatever, you know, all this building materials basically. Uh, so cost. Danger on site. Uh, check it out. 2014. Wait for it. <laughs> oh, I've seen that before. Uh, we'll be able to build intergalactically, apparently, on the moon. <laughs> I'm not sure about that. I don't think so. But anyway, 
Uh, but you'd be able to 3D print a lot of stuff on site, basically, that's what they're saying. Uh, that um, must be their office saying. Uh, here you go. This is um, uh, the, uh, the idea <laughs> of a building site in, uh, in 2014. So, uh, so two uh, lot of Terminator. Uh, yeah, well, basically them. everything comes in just <laughs> in time. There's nothing stored on site, and uh, you just, uh, it just gets dropped where it has to get dropped. Um, so quite easy. Uh, <laughs> the quad copters have uh, improved. It must be a 3D printer or a CNC machine or something there. Uh, of course, um, we probably all have seen, and a lot of my students have seen, uh, the, uh, the YouTube video of the uh, 3D printed house in, in China and that sort of thing. There's a few of them around. Um, so, you know, that's, that sort of stuff will just happen. You know, it will improve. We'll be able to uh, lay... Uh, out your um, reinforcement and fit your printer straight into into your uh, footings and that sort of stuff uh, by then. Uh, yeah, so um, People this. Are smiling still. Hey? People are smiling still. What do you mean? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> they're still happy. I mean, uh, they're still um, quite skilled people. It's just that you haven't got skilled carpenters on site. You know, you have other people that are controlling the machines, and so you're still going to have your skilled people in the building industry. Um, and this is a driver. It works for tourists. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, yeah, that's, that's yeah, they're out there. Um, but this is um, um, a driverless uh, excavator. You can work 24/7. It's pre-programmed. Doesn't matter if it's raining or shining or whatever. Um, it will just uh, uh, so we'll get efficiencies from that sort of thing because you know beam will fit into that um, or the data and off it goes and and does it. So all I see that all I think of is that. Yeah, you set up to print overnight, and you come back, and the printer's gone wrong. Yeah, so imagine that. Thing. <laughs> 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 the wrong spot. <laughs> hey, but your render comes back all right from the cloud. <laughs> Same <Similar> thing. <laughs> all right. So um, yeah, there you go. Some more uh, concrete sort of pumping stuff. Um, yeah, and this sort of stuff happens now. Anyway, this is a real thing. You know, we all can build complex sort of wars and that sort of stuff um, with robots. Um, the, the that's a quad copter. This is an inverted quad copter, I think they call it. Uh, so it sucks air up, therefore less dust on site. That will that will be what, what's going to happen apparently. Um, you know, we have uh, Google Glass helping you out, and um, being able to spot uh, dangers and, and warn you on site. You know, there's a hole down here. Oh, where's my thing? You <laughs> go down there. So it will give you a warning up here. Open pit. <laughs> All right. Okay. There you go. Also, being able to see uh, at night uh, with a better better vision. So that's what it's going to look like if you have enhanced vision. All right. So that's. All this sort of stuff, stuff is still on the pipeline. This is the one I loved. This is a holographic of you on someone's watch, watching, uh, walking around on site. You know, so obvious it's be a piece of cake, right? You don't have to leave your office and keep, keep cool. <laughs> a bit dizzy now, a bit nauseous. <laughs> so uh, all this sort of, um, you know, point cloud scanning. Um, would be a lot more uh, actually it would look a bit better than that I think <laughs> but then it's already looking better than that anyhow um, trades people yes we have trades people this is your trades person of the future you know fixing machines and uh, programming them uh, uh, programming robots and all that sort of stuff business process um, I can't remember about that but they, they basically they, they talked about uh, progress payments and that sort of thing so um, that's the little handout uh, just to run through um, what I didn't mention on mention on that. Uh, this is a co copters are in there. Um, excavators I talked about. Google Tango, Google Glass. Um, yeah, 3D. Ah, oh, 3D animations of assemblies and details will come be more um, sort of widespread. Thus, uh, on a multilingual in, um, site, English won't be necessary, necessary for workers to build stuff because they'll be able to watch a video of it. Um, we have a lot more CNC cutting happening, uh, drywall materials delivered on site, saved materials, um, basically no carpenters, etc. Uh, will be needed in the future, it says. Uh, so it'll be all robotically done. Um, to make this, yeah, to make this uh, change, um, we will need uh, you know, this sort of stuff to happen. So we have integrated system and in, uh, integrated team. In other words, RPD, integrated project delivery. 
uh, no duplications of the beam, and that's sort of happening um, with that little thing you, saw, uh, you showed a bit earlier on, uh, but there's another thing called sky uh, skyscraper, I think it's called, uh, which is coming in, be basically rev it on the cloud. I'll talk about that later if I get a chance. Um, all right, so uh, basically um, we need to change the construction process. Bidding would not be necessary. It's estimating would not be required. Just have, the, have to calculate the costs. Progress payments will, be, will change. The verification process